How about this? The original Oyster House turned 150 today, making it the oldest restaurant in the city of Pittsburgh. And being a century and a half old, it is not the restaurant's first pandemic. Yeah, David, that's hard to believe, but it survived the Spanish flu outbreak of 1918. And now Channel 11's Aaron Martin shows us how this Market Square staple plans to persevere. Over the last century and a half, Pittsburgh has transformed several times over, including here at Market Square, which used to be a hub of industry and is now full of bars and restaurants. But one thing that hasn't changed, the original Oyster House, the oldest restaurant in the city, which is celebrating 150 years today. My dad always said to me, you'd be very grateful for this town and for this business because it's allowed us to live the life we've led, and I've never forgotten that. It's a lesson that stayed in the Grippo family for generations and continues in their operation of a Pittsburgh staple. Today, the original Oyster House celebrated 150 years of operation, cementing its status as the longest running restaurant in Pittsburgh. It's a part of Pittsburgh history. I mean, it, it goes back not only 150 years, but this space and this, this little area goes back all the way back to the Fort Pitt days. The Oyster House faced depressions, downturns, and even a previous pandemic. But few years have been as challenging as 2020, where restaurants and bars have struggled to stay afloat in the age of COVID-19. Through it all, owner Jen Grippo says they're still hanging on. We have survived so many different things that have happened here in Pittsburgh. And it's really just a testament to how resilient this business can be. While loyal customers have kept the restaurant going, new customers are still discovering it. Oh, we had to come. It was the 150th anniversary. You know, it's like a Pittsburgh tradition. It may be his family's first time, but Eric Baeza says it won't be the last. We have to support local businesses, you know, and, uh, you know, anything that's Pittsburgh, you know, owned uh, by Pittsburgh families, we should definitely support, you know, in these times, in these rough times. And today also carries a special significance for the Grippo family, which has now owned the original Oyster House for 50 years, something they hope will continue well into the future. Reporting tonight in Market Square, Aaron Martin, Channel 11 News.